Hello, this is Chaos Kalu, and welcome to more Let's Play Final Fantasy VI! We are in the Velt. We just recruited Gao, who I'm going to go over and stuff with it in a minute or two. But first, we have stuff to do inside the town. Mo Blitz. Namely, something that I forgot to do last time. Uh, also. I just realized I haven't given anyone the sprint shoes yet. Well, let's, let's, let's fix that. Let's go with... Let's go with the Mithril Glove, because why not? But yeah, we want to come up here. I think this is the right house. Yeah, that's the one. So, you want to send a letter to... Lola for that injured soldier. Postage to Miranda is 500 gil. We are gonna send it. We should have done this immediately before, but I forgot. Oh well. Wow. Anywho, uh, if we go back here, I just need to make sure I'm on track. Okay. Now that we've done that... Yeah, okay. Really wanted to make sure. Now that we've done that, we can go weapon shopping! Which I've been putting off until now. The reason I've done this should become apparent in... well... today. Anyway... <laughs> No one. Nope. We do want one of those. And as for armor, we want a lot of stuff actually. We can get iron armor for a lot of people. Uh, although, only one person we're with right now. We can get this for Gao. We can get our helmets for everyone, but we're only buying stuff for people who are with us, because it's expensive. Ooh, maybe I should have gotten a bandana. Hmm. Hard to say. Magus hat is good, but not happening. Heavy shield. Is that... I think that's everything. Let's go ahead and equip our stuff. That should tell us if we have any holes pretty quickly. You know, you didn't even get anything new. Oh, he has the green barrette. That explains that. Kotatsu! Heavy shield! Pretty good magic defense. Well, well, for this point in the game, well, not really. <laughs> okay, I take it back. Iron armor! Ooh, lower speed. Oh well. Still the buckler. Iron helmet. Kempo. Now I just want to double check to make sure that Badana isn't better. Nope, it's not. It says I have one equipped it. I wonder on who. Maybe it's on Shadow. That's possible. Anyway. Anyway. Wait. Wait. Okay. And we're gonna not sell our equipment just yet because we never know when we have a char we'll have a character who suddenly needs new equipment. And I mean that in regards to the past split, let me assure you. Because I honestly have no idea what Terra or uh, Edgar, or Bannon for that matter, have equipped it. Anyway, now that we've done that, we should be able to... Yep, we can. I can't find your favorite record. I thought if I played it, it might feel like you were he here with me again. I'd do anything for Lola, if only I could move. 
Well, we can probably help out with that a bit. Yep. Uh, we have enough money. Okay. And now that we've done that, we're gonna go out again. I think you know what's going on here. There's a number of events we can do with this guy. To trigger them, generally you just need to go and do something else, whether it's some on the world map or visit the inn or shopping. Doesn't really matter. But you need to go do stuff. Uh, and at the end, we get an item. So, anyway, let's go do stuff. It's time for the map. Okay, well, this is not even worth jumping on. Because I need to demonstrate how Leap works, but... Well, first of all, here's Rage. Look at this list already. Four, six, eight. We have nine of them to start off with. And there's a bloody lot of rages. Let's use Magitek armor. Now. Most of the rages are... A lot of the rages are not really worth getting. But there's a few that are. Uh, well, there's... Let's put it this way. There's more than three right now that are good enough that we would want them. That said... I don't really want to wait around that long to look for them, because for one thing, it's a total headache just keeping track of them all, there's so many. But also, it can be quite time consuming to find them, potentially. I am only particularly interested in three. Although, I'm probably going to pick up a few extra ones as well. As we go along. Uh, I should rephrase that. I'm only interested in three right now. Obviously, as the game goes on, there's more I'm gonna want. But, there's three in particular that we definitely have access to right now. Uh, all of them, we, in fact, you get from Sabin's Root. So, you always have access to them. And they are extremely useful for various reasons, if we actually run into one. Or hell, I will settle with just a regular monster that I even... That isn't... Well, I, I could have done the Trillium, I guess. Oh yeah, I don't know if I mentioned this before, but a lot of Gal's Rages have magic attacks. So... You want to watch out for those, because that, if you know what rages to use, they're a very good source of relatively powerful magic attacks at this point in the game. We did not want to go in here yet, but since we are in here, may as well go back up here. Oh? There's no letter this time. Maybe going on the world map doesn't count for that. I'm pretty sure it should, though. That's odd. Well, I guess I can just visit the inn or something. Oh yeah, I haven't been to the relic shop, so I can go there. But, you know, let's do the damn Gao thing. Okay, you guys work. You work for me. Leap! Okay, so here's what- uh-oh. Damn it, Cyan! Why did you counterattack? I, uh, that was unfortunate. <laughs> okay, so anyway, I'll just explain now. Here's how the leap thing works. When you leap onto the enemy, Gout goes with them for a few battles. Then you get him. Then eventually, you'll encounter him again. I guess I'd have him go with the Silver Lobo. I don't know. When Gao comes back, he gets two sets of um, rages. He gets the rages for the monsters that he- Damn it, Cyan, stop doing that! Great, I didn't even want that guy. Anyway, he gets the rages for the monsters that he leapt onto, but he also gets them for- just a sec. You have lost your counterattack privileges. Okay, but he also gets the rages for the monst- 
This is for a party that he comes back on. Uh, I think I actually won a deal. Did I? I mean, you're not in my top three, but... I'm pretty sure you are reasonably okay? I don't know. I don't remember a lot of the good ones, to be honest. I have a list, but it's a really long list. Which is why I'm only going after a few ones in particular that I know are great. Because I can remember them. Like this one, actually. This... I really hope Gao comes back after this battle, because this satellite is in my top three. I think it is anyway. Well, my thing says Telstar, but I'm pretty sure it's the same enemy. It, it's the monster that we got into a, uh, uh-oh, Sabin? Sabin! Don't be berserked! That is so dangerous! Matt, it, it, if you hit Gao, he will run away. So... Alarm sounds... Oh yeah, I forgot that it did that. A any and if he runs away, then you don't get the rages from that battle. Although he will show up in the next battle, usually. But yeah, the satellite. It's the monster you fight as a monster in a box from the box that we opened in the Imperial Camp. And it is good for two reasons. Well, a few reasons, actually. Oh, we didn't get Ga- We did get a green barrette, though. That's actually really good. Wow. That's- Wow, I didn't know that that happened. I think we just got really lucky there. But it might have just been because it recorded it from the- Because it was a monster in the box, you know? In any case, you want the satellite because it floats, which means it's hard to... Well... No, that's not true. Mostly you want it because it's immune to most status effects. It has a decent attack power, but you mostly want it because it's immune to a whole lot of status effects. Which, incidentally, also means it's really important to open that box in the Imperial Camp. Uh, these things are another thing that- wait, no. Are they? I could be wrong. They're not on my top ten list, okay? Top ten. Top five, I mean. Top three. Three! I meant three. But I think they're okay. I really need to repeat. I can't freaking remember what any of the stuff in my top uh, any of my top ones are, except for my top three. It's just- it's sort of a pain, really. I suggest going on to GameFAQs and looking at the uh, ra at a rage guide. There's several. If you want a list, the good ones should ha get tell you which ones the uh, well, it should tell you which one the good rages are. In any case, I'll try to point out for you which ones that I want. If nothing else, between this episode and the next one, I'll make sure to show you uh, the important three. But we have Gao now, and he has new rages. If I can look at his... there we go. Yeah, he has... you see this list is awful. Well, he has Guard now, which is kind of awful. Silver Lobo, which is also not very good. And He does not seem to have Ghost. Maybe I lied about that. Maybe that's only in the Super, Super Nintendo version. Well, whatever. It doesn't matter. Not really. Oh yeah. Let's give you the... No, I gave it to Cyan already. Oh well. Let's hurry up and just finish this part now. Do you have a letter? Now that Gao is back, you do not. That means we should stay in the inn, I guess. Because... Eh. Oh well. 
Time Passage in Final Fantasy VI is kind of just don't look at it too hard. It's also worth mentioning, actually, there is a spot in this town where you can rest for free. I believe there there's a bed in the relic shop, which I haven't been to yet, it's on my list. But, it's 100 gil, and in this case we need it to pass time. And I'm not certain if the bed in the relic shop will pass time for this purpose. Honestly, I've never bothered testing it. I probably should. <laughs> Mother has taken ill, and we can't afford to buy medicine. If only we had some more potion. Well. Well. May as well deal with that. Send a potion for 500 gil. That is highway robbery. Uh, but what you gonna do, I suppose? Is this the relic shop? No, it's the item shop. Is... Where's the relic shop? I don't rem I think it's over here. No, it's up there. Well, at least I found it. Oh, hey, cabbages! And people! Right, then. Good luck with that. They look familiar, actually. Hmm... Relic shop. Um, I think this is yeah, immunity to imp and silence. It is really expensive and not really very useful. But having said that, ah, uh, well, hmm. Normally, I would buy this, except that I have a ribbon, which is strictly better and it's really expensive. So I'm not going to. Yeah, this bed right here you can rest in. Anyway, I don't think we actually need to buy anything, but let's let well let's find out I suppose. We do not. I haven't heard from you for some time now, and I'm beginning to worry. Yeah, you would, wouldn't you? Well. Time to send another letter. Yep. Now, may as well see if resting in the bed in here counts. Does it count? Does it, does it, does it? Out of the way. Thank you. It does not. Fortunately, we already know that we don't actually need to buy sh anything. We just need to open a shop menu. Again, time flow, just... Just don't even bring it up. It's, it's a thing that happens, but beyond that, there's... There's no real consistency. And a letter! All we had to do was go to the item shop! You mentioned in a book in your last letter. Or you mentioned a book. Someday you'll have to let me read it too. So much letters. I assure you there is an end to this though. I think we're close to it, in fact. Send a book? Well, I don't know if that's a more of a markup than the potion or not, to be honest. I suppose it depends on the book. Let's go into the here again, I guess? I don't know. Hmm. I'm not sure if the satellite enemy drops green barrettes 100% of the time. Although I suspect it might. That's not something I've... Oh. I heard you've been sending Lola all kinds of things in my name. I wish to thank you from the bottom of my heart. Please accept this as a token of my appreciation. We obtained the tin ten the tin tab. <coughs> yes, that thing. What is that? I actually don't. Not sure. I'm pretty sure it's a relic. If I can just press the right button, 
It is! It has some rings and it restores HP every time you take a step on the map. Or a town, or a dungeon, or what have you. It's pretty interesting. I don't think it's really very useful, to be honest. Although, if you are in really dire straits and you use it to wander around a town and heal up to free, I suppose. Heal your HP up to free, it won't do MP. Although, that's not a concern with our current party, I suppose. In any case, now that I have that taken care of, we are almost done here in the Velp. I just need to collect a few rages for Gao, which I'm going to do off screen, and then we can go to the Crescent Mountains, or whatever the hell that place is called. So, until next time, when I'll show you those rages, this has been Let's Play Final Fantasy VI with Chaos Baloo, and have a good day.